All the world's a stage is the phrase that begins a monologue from William Shakespeare's pastoral comedy As You Like It, spoken by the melancholy Jacques in Act II, Scene 7, Line 138. The speech compares the world to a stage and life to a play and catalogues the seven stages of a man's life, sometimes referred to as the seven ages of man infant, schoolboy, lover, soldier, justice, pantalone, and old age, facing imminent death. It is one of Shakespeare's most frequently quoted passages. Topic Text Topic Origins Topic World as a Stage The comparison of the world to a stage and people to actors long predated Shakespeare. Juvenal, the ancient Roman poet, wrote one of the earliest versions of this line in his Satire 3, All of Greece is a stage, and every Greek's an actor. Richard Edwards' play Damon and Pythias, written in the year Shakespeare was born, contains the lines, Pythagoras said that this world was like a stage, whereon many play their parts, the lookers on, the sage. When it was founded in 1599 Shakespeare's own theatre, the Globe, may have used the motto totus mundus agit histronem all the world plays the actor, the Latin text of which is derived from a 12th century treatise. Ultimately the words derive from quod fia totus mundus exercit histronem because almost the whole world are actors attributed to Petronius, a phrase which had wide circulation in England at the time. In his own earlier work, The Merchant of Venice, Shakespeare also had one of his main characters, Antonio, comparing the world to a stage. In his work The Praise of Folly, first printed in 1511, Renaissance humanist Erasmus asks, for what else is the life of man but a kind of play in which men in various costumes perform until the director motions them off the stage. <laughs> <laughs> Ages of man Likewise the division of human life into a series of ages was a commonplace of art and literature, which Shakespeare would have expected his audiences to recognize. The number of ages varied, three and four being the most common among ancient writers such as Aristotle. The concept of seven ages derives from medieval philosophy, which constructed groups of seven, as in the seven deadly sins, for theological reasons. The seven ages model dates from the 12th century. King Henry V had a tapestry illustrating the seven ages of man. According to T. W. Baldwin, Shakespeare's version of the concept of the ages of man is based primarily upon Palingenius's book Zodiacus Vitae, a school text he would have studied at the Stratford Grammar School, which also enumerates stages of human life. He also takes elements from Ovid and other sources known to him. See also The Seven Ages of Man painting series. Ages of Man Riddle of the Sphinx Six Ages of the World Solomon Grundy Mere Oblivion short film. The Seven Doors of Danny musical theater.